local. All right, so in this case, I have secant of theta equals negative 1. And what I need to do is evaluate for what is my angle of theta um, when the secant of theta of that angle is equal to negative 1. So remember, when we're kind of thinking about secant, we know that secant of an angle represents 1 over my x coordinate, right? So what I really need to do is kind of determine, well, therefore, for 1 divided by what number is going to have to make this negative 1? Well, the only answer that I can really have for x would be when x equals negative 1. And remember, going back into the cosine function, cosine of theta is just going to equal um, when cosine of theta equals uh, just cosine of theta equals x. So therefore, we want to also really kind of determine when cosine of theta is going to equal negative 1. So I need to look at this and determine, well, where on this unit circle is my cosine of x equal to negative 1? Because that's going to be really the same thing as far as finding the secant of negative 1. And that angle has to be between 0 and 2 pi. Well, I know that this point is 1 comma 0. And since the unit circle has a radius of 1, I know that this point over here is also going to be, is going to be negative 1 over 0. And these other two coordinates are at 0, 1 and 0, uh, negative 1. So therefore, the, co the x value is not going to be 0, not negative 1. So the only angle where x equals negative 1, and therefore secant of theta is going to equal negative 1, is at this angle. Well, remember, if we start here and we go all the way around, halfway around is pi halves. So all the way um, around half a circle, that kind of seems weird, but all the way around half a circle is just going to equal theta, is just going to equal pi. So therefore, theta in this example equals the angle pi. And we can't go in the positive or uh, an extra revolution or in the negative direction because our angle has to be between 0 and 2 pi. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you evaluate theta given your angle. Thanks.